Prime Minister keeps insisting that Senator Irving Gerstein is not under investigation by the RCMP, but Mr. Gerstein's name comes up repeatedly in court documents. He played a role in the payoff, and the RCMP have never said that he's not a part of their investigation. So can the Prime Minister share with Canadians how he knows that Senator Gerstein is not under investigation? The documents uh, submitted by the RCMP quite clearly indicate who is uh, under investigation, and that is uh, Senator Duffy and Nigel Wright. Thank you. Right the Honourable Member for Halifax. Yesterday, when asked about Mr. Van Hemmen, the Prime Minister replied, quote, it's a long-standing practice to cover legal fees to such individuals. But these fees were related to RCMP investigation and to Nigel Wright, and Mike Duffy. So why are the taxpayers being left on the hook to defend PMO staff from the RCP RCMP's investigation into conservative corruption? Very good question. The Honourable Parliament for Secretary of the Prime Minister. As the Prime Minister uh, stated the other day, it is uh, a long-standing government policy that predates uh, our government where ministers of the Crown and their staff uh, uh, do have access to legal assistance uh, uh, with respect to their activities of the, uh, that they undertake as part of the government uh, function. Thank you. And the Honourable Member for Halifax. Mr. Speaker, when the news broke first through Nigel Wright and then through the RCMP that many people in the PMO were involved, did the Prime Minister confront his staff and demand answers as to why they have misled him? Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Quite clearly in these uh, documents, it states the uh, leadership that the Prime Minister did show. Of course, he went uh, into his office immediately and insisted that his office assist the RCMP in its investigation, Mr. Speaker. Staff has, of course, provided all necessary waivers to, uh, to uh, assist with the RCMP. Thousands of emails were turned over, uh, uh, Mr. Speaker. That's the type of leadership I think most Canadians have come to depend on from this Prime Minister. And it's the type of leadership we'll continue to provide Canadians.